A team of international experts may get access to the site of an alleged chemical weapons attack in Syria. Syrian state TV said the country's foreign minister and United Nations disarmament chief Angela Kane struck a deal Sunday. The UN says the team, already on the ground, will prepare for an on-site fact-finding mission. Anti-government activists claim more than 300 people were killed when the Syrian regime fired toxic gas last week while fighting rebels east of Damascus. World leaders, even the Pope, have condemned use of chemical weapons. Everyone has seen the terrible images broadcast in recent days. This compels me to speak out against the warfare. Sunday, an unnamed White House official said there was very little doubt chemical weapons were used. The alleged attack has renewed talk of the possibility of foreign military action, but the U.S. Defense Secretary offered no hints of a response. President Obama has asked the Defense Department to prepare uh, options uh, for all contingencies. Uh, we have done that. The Syrian government denies the allegations, and the U.N. says the regime has agreed to cease fighting in areas related to the incident. If proven true, the attack could greatly influence the future course of the Syrian conflict. Cindy Sharp, Associated Press.